So today is day 13. I'm super excited today. Uh, I'm going today to Tampa. Tampa is uh, two hours and 20 minutes from, from where I live. And I saw a sign recently that I'm still near like 65 miles. So Tampa is a very interesting place because it's the, uh, like the capital of Florida. So the government over there, it's, uh, I mean, it, I don't know if it's called also a city hall, but it's like the government of Florida. Um, also, I got yesterday, like, another new sign. I'm very excited for that. You will see it later. I'll show it later. And let's keep going. Uh, if you're watching this recording later, uh, you Christian, I ask you to pray. Pray for the cities I've been, for people I talk to, and and pray. So I'm, I'm just want to give you that small homework to to pray for for those cities. If you see the whole series, there are some people who received Jesus Christ. Pray for them too. And I don't know. Maybe you're next. Maybe you're the next. You are the next. You will do the next rally. You know. Also, uh, I mean, when, when God takes you to conquer something, probably. I mean, you have that already. Maybe you have to keep doing it again, or, or I don't know exactly how it works. But I'm thinking about that. I mean, I have to pray, of course, uh, probably next year, yeah, I'll do it again. I'm not sure if do it in Florida again. I'm not sure if uh, thinking about another state or not sure if doing it in, there are some cities like far away from my house, like four or five hours away, that probably that will be an option too. And if you're, in, if you're a real Christian and you have like some time with the Lord, you know the scriptures, I mean the, the basic at least, and you have the willingness like to, to do this, to be like on the streets preaching and holding signs and things like that, um, probably for the next one I'll try to prepare a team so that we can go out in like two cars or three cars, I don't know three people, five people, and, and we can do like a, like a bigger job, you know? I mean, uh, I don't know if I told you yesterday, but God is hiring, you know, in the kingdom of God, always there is vac vacant, vacancies, because as Jesus says, the harvest is too much. I mean, there are too much work and a few labors. That's different than churches because in a church, maybe like five people preach and, and there is one church and then one preach one one weekend, one preach another one. But on the street, there are thousands, thousands and thousands of corners that you can stand with signs that you can preach. Hundreds and thousands of commercial centers that you can give tracts. So in the kingdom, of, of God, I mean, in, in the, on the streets, always there are vacancies, okay? So have a great day, let's see what's going on later, and I mean, on the way to Tampa, very interesting city. So almost, almost arriving, it's like 10 minutes to the city hall of Tampa. Uh, there is a slow down here. In 600 feet, merge onto I-4 West. I mean, this is a huge city. Uh, I'm seeing over there like a downtown. It looks this like Miami or something. I mean, not that big as Miami, but I see a lot of big buildings over there. Uh, there's a slowdown here. So hopefully I stay in a few places today. I'm very happy because I have a new sign. So let's see how is it going today. 
Continue for one mile. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, he opens the door needs to be open and close the door needs to be closed. They start amazing. You see a lot of people over there. Uh, it looks like they are homeless and some people are giving them coffee. I give tracks to most of them. Someone didn't take it. But the interesting thing is that I give, sometimes I, I say in the church, hey, if you don't want clothes, if something you don't like, just give it to me, I'll pass it out. And people at church know me already and they give me clothes. And the good thing is my daughter yesterday prepared like 10 packages of clothes for people. So hopefully there will be any problem because I don't have to for all of them. But at least I'll have like for half of them. Let's see what's going on. I have the clothes here. I'm going to give it to them. And then I'm going to start preaching here. This is the, yeah, like the, like the city center. And I like it because uh, there are people, like some people walking around. Also, probably I start preaching over there. And I'm not saying that I'm giving the clothes uh, to look like good or anything. No one is good, only God is good. And those clothes are not even mine. People at church give it to me, I'll give it to them. And I'm telling you that as another idea that things you can do. Maybe you don't have, but if you say in a church or whatever, or somewhere, people have a lot of clothes that they don't use. They can give it to you. You know, and then you pass it to someone who needed it. Uh, that's it. Um, so let's keep going. Let's see what's going on. Hey, that's a surprise. That's my new acquisition, you know. An amazing sign presenting a true and cruel reality that we have nowadays. So we're here in front of the city hall. City hall Tampa. Over there. There are some people walking, some people walking around, so probably I'll be preaching here. A lot of cars coming from there and then they stop here in the light. So I'll be in this corner for a while. Let's see what's going on. Amazing day today. Uh, that's fishing in this corner uh, probably I'm gonna move now I have those two signs over there I put those two in the other corner over there I'm holding those two that's the most I can do man I cannot do too much so probably I'm gonna do a different strategy in this city probably I'll be like walking around on the corners and like preach five to ten minutes in, in different corners I mean when you have big buildings like this there are for sure people people walking you know because in those big buildings those kind of cities uh, there are not too much parking but here there are parkings but um, I mean you can see people walking around it's not like for example when I was in West Palm Beach for a lot of those kind of city that people are in the car all the time but in this kind of uh, huge cities there are a lot of people walking all the time you know tourists people go to work things like that so I'm gonna use that strategy today I don't know if I will move later probably yes of course but I will try to be in, in a few corners let's see I was in front of the city hall many police pa pass by around no one had told me anything so I think I'm, I'm okay I'm good to go so let's let's keep going thing is that those kind of city that there are not like grass on the corners I said oh where I'm gonna put the, the jar sign and God gave me the idea you know there is a small piece over there but over there you can put the jar sign but wow, that was amazing so everything perfect some small bad news 
I just run out of tracks and that was my responsibility because I I already print a lot in English but I only have them in Spanish most people here take it in English I mean I have a lot at home but just say uh, uh, we were talking as a family you know spending time and I forgot to start cutting uh, verse of Bibles my daughter helped me my, my wife my son too so we, we do it together but yesterday we didn't so but I also have the signs and I have the the speaker so let's see what's going on here a little bit more um, as you can listen there is a big noise over there There's some people working over there uh, but I'm gonna stay here with the signs there are some cars coming from there some other cars coming from there and I'll take a few moments like to edit it yesterday videos Let's see what's going on. Then we will move, move on to another corner. So there are a lot of corners over here. Lord have mercy. In the name of Jesus Christ. Let the people see your light. Thank you, Lord, because you died for us in the cross. And salvation is a free gift. It's a free gift from God, but you have to repay. When Jesus forgave the lady in adultery, he told her, go and see no more. That's what people don't like. Don't like that part, to see no more. People are creating their own religion because in their own religion you can do whatever you want and you think you go to heaven and you think you're good to go. Well, let me tell you that that's not truth. The truth is that Jesus died for our sin in the cross to pay with his blood, but you have to repent. You have to repent, truly repent.
those five guys offered tracks, they they didn't get it. Sorry, dog. So I'm at a public library now. Mm, I'm ready to start preaching. I came here to upload the videos, five videos from last week, one per day. So it's done, it's scheduled to go up once a day. So I'm, I'm resting a little bit, kind of tired. But then probably I'm gonna walk where I have my car parking and then I move on to somewhere else. I mean, this is like the center of the city. There are people walking around and everything. Let's see, let's see what's going on. I'll check the map to see where I could go. I was in this corner. I was reading Matthew 13, the parable of the sower, and then I read the explanation that Jesus himself did it. So there's no way you can prove that. So that's the explanation, 100% from the scripture. There are a few people over there sitting. Uh, there are many cars coming from there. From that line from the truck is coming and keep here sharing the word so i'm gonna stand over there that's the university of tampa that's what it was like in muscle and stuff but you know it's the university of tampa I mean, there is darkness everywhere, so <laughs> anywhere you can stand, that's a good place. It's, it's like a circle, very interesting to me. It's super high. Super busy corner over here. And I have six signs, six yard signs. Well, I'll, I'll, I'll show you later. A lot of cars come in this corner. So I'm gonna read the Bible today, John chapter. Okay, we're, we're reading the Bible today, John chapter 14. That's the Word of God, the most accurate prophecy that we have, the Word of God. John 14. Let not your heart be troubled. You believe in God, believe also in me. Verse 2. In my father's house, there are many mansions. If it were not, so I would have gone. I go to prepare a place for you. And if 
over there waiting those cars check the signs see those signs over here
the world Jesus answered and says to him I keep reading verse 23 verse 23 if a man love me he will give my word and my father will love me and we will come to him and make our abode with him it's very simple if a man love me he's talking about Jesus Christ keep my word and my father will love him and he will come to him and make our abode with him continue now in verse 24 this is a small chapter only 31 verses we're going to verse 24 verse 24 he that loved me not gives not my saying and the world with you here is but the Father which sent me, these things I have, have I spoke to you, being yet present with you, but the Comforter, which is the Holy Spirit. Let's hear Holy Ghost, I prefer to say Holy Spirit, whom the Father will send in my name. Holy Spirit is also in other versions. I'm not just putting words by myself. He shall teach. All things and bring all things to you. Remembrance whatsoever I have said to you. Peace, I live with you. My peace I give it to you. Not as the world gives. Give I to you. Let not your heart be troubled. Neither let it be afraid. You have heard now I said to you. I go away and I come again to you. Don't 
like the setup and here look at this very huge highway huge highway over here a lot of cars over there but there are seven lines two lines torn to the left which are the people that mostly uh listen to me four lines go front and one line go to the right so people from there they can see those three signs over here so i have the this one which i'm very happy you know now i have six yard signs and this is lovely all those three you can see from the front very very easily so there are some cars over there that when they turn they can see those signs too but also those cars and those ones over here they can check those two i put those two together because some people say ah oh, don't hate no, it's not hating it's, it's, it's reality you know this is love you abortion is mortal i was putting the camera over there was recording the and then i have over there some other people come from there and there's a big line over there too and you see spanish but in the other side is the Indian side so i like the setup here i have more jar signs now thanks the lord almighty i got two more yesterday you know uh God give me the strength because you know I'm doing this uh, just with him alone. So when someone comes, I feel extremely happy because you don't know how important is help on this. If you see, sometimes I record the videos like from the ground because I put the cell phone on the ground uh, with something with with, uh, with in the grass because uh, you know holding the signs sometimes i have to park and walk a little bit and walking we hold the sign plus the the tree but i mean i just put the cell phone just to record a minute or something you know well thanks for the support for watching share the good news i mean i i feel very happy i i listen to a lot of street preacher and that makes me uh very very happy that god is raising people everywhere I mean, a street preacher are like the warriors of God. I mean, I'm just doing it this month, but there are some people that literally do it every day, like the whole year. I mean, I'm just doing it just this month right now, but there are people that are over there in the world the full, the full year. So God bless them. Um, and, and if you like it, you feel your heart is burning when you see something like this uh maybe god's calling you maybe god is calling you and and if you join someone who's already doing it you you it will be easier for you to start you know but definitely god wants to use you there is no question about that there is a lot of work to do and there are not too many people god wants to use you there is no question about that there is a lot of work to do and there are not too many people i just step right now here and a man in a bike, probably, let me see if you can see, oh no, it's over there, no, you don't see. So he told me that, I, I told him, hey, how are you? Um, are you Christian? Are you going to church? And he told me, I have four religions in my family. So like, he was like tough of a religion saying, yeah, I understand that, you know, because religion don't save, only Jesus saves. So religion is just main creation. Don't, don't just go for that. And I was talking to him. And then I told him, you know, that the, Jesus shared his blood in the cross. You know? Believe in him, he's a real one. I don't, I don't have any religion. Religion is man creation. I mean, I, I told him a little bit. He was like thinking at the end, but the, the, ring, the green light to cross the street. And he just said, I, I had to go, I had to go, you know. People do not uh, stop and think, you know. If I told him, hey, you know, let me talk to you for a little bit. I'm, I'm going to give you like $300 or something like that. I'm sure he will stay like 10 minutes. But salvation is even greater. There is nothing greater than eternity. What business can you tell me which is better than to be safe in the Lord Jesus Christ? There, there isn't. So, but you know... 
keep praying. I, I ask you to pray. Uh, I mean, uh, I have my colleagues to be on the street. Uh, I, I understand I'm not, I don't have like the pastor calling to be in a church. That's a different calling. And, you know, uh, I'm not so good at like doing the follow up. I mean, I have talked to a lot of people in my life sharing the gospel. And I usually don't do follow up. Probably I have to work on that and, and I should be better on that. Definitely, I have to improve that. So um, just pray for, for this city. The city of Tampa is the capital of Florida. And have a great day. over there that, that bus I saw many people watching to the signs I mean I'm here with the three signs and the Jesus saved from hell Th those signs you see from far away people in that bus are checking the signs here we go slow traffic but even slow traffic I can preach with the car you know? that's uh, I'm not worried about it road and I saw that sign that sign, wow, that's amazing. The church is doing his job here. You see? Let's see what we're doing. I don't do video. I don't do video. So I'm here now. Uh, the sign I present that pray, uh, we pray for you. Can I pray for you? That's an amazing sign. There are here four gentlemen praying. We pray here. And this is what the church needs to do. We need to pray first and also share Jesus Christ. I have here with my brother in Christ. What's your name? Bobby. Bobby. Priest. Yeah, Bobby. Uh, what would you tell people? What what people should do in this time? I would like to tell everybody in the United States: to, uh, the harvest is great, and the labors are few. We need a yeah. lot more people out witnessing to people to come to Christ. Totally agree. You want to share any verse of the Bible or anything? For God verse? so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in Him should not perish, That's but have right. everlasting That's life. Right. God bless you. God bless you. That looks weird to me, that kind of stuff. We're going home. Um, basically, the, the people I talk at the end over there, uh, they pray for me. Uh, we were praying. Uh, that's I like that a lot. I mean, they were, you know, praying for people around with those signs. That's amazing. Pray, prayers is super, super important. Sometimes people want to do things. But the first thing you have to do is to pray. Um, so basically, we finished today. Uh, I mean, I had the chance to, to preach a few corners, went around with the sign. I put the videos, I uploaded the five videos from last week. But I didn't have, so I didn't bring enough tracks. That, that was a problem. But anyway, six, almost 6.30, two hours and a half back driving. It's almost driving home at night. I mean, I would like to to visit another, there was another place with a lot of uh, commercial center I would like to give track, but I didn't bring the track. And anyway, I don't, I don't have too much time, you know. It's almost too late, driving home too late. So, um, I mean, I feel very happy. I was standing with the signs a long time in some corners. And also I was in front of the university. I mean, that, that's a very important place. 
no positioning in the spiritual I was able to pray for the university and yeah being in front of the university well uh, I like that so thanks God I'm going in this side of the road because the other side